guys, welcome back to a new video. It's me, your friend, Anushka. I hope you're all doing really well. So today we're going to be doing a Indian inspired wedding guest makeup. I, I received this really, really nice um, outfit by Ara UK on Instagram. I'll link them in the info box. This is not paid, but they sent me this. I was initially going to pay for it. They were recommended by Skin Face Beauty and the outfits looked really nice and they were kind enough to send me one, but I'm definitely going to be purchasing from them again because this outfit is beautiful and I'll post a picture on Instagram, so make sure to check out my Instagram. But this outfit really inspired me to do like a I don't know, an Indian wedding guest makeup. Um, I know you guys love these types of videos, so yeah. And I didn't, I also didn't, because of work and everything, it's been really difficult to film and I wanted to get, I didn't get as much content out for Eid as I wanted to, because usually every year I do a bunch of videos for Eid. So yeah, we're just gonna be doing that. I feel like because it's white, I can do anything with my face. So we're gonna go more of like a corally vibe today. Before we jump into the video, I'm going to give my post notification shout out and today's one's going to go to Alicia underscore ZX. So thank you so much for leaving a comment. If you guys want to get one next time, all you have to do is subscribe, press the bell button and then let me know in the comments below when you've done so or you can just leave a nice comment. Right, so I really need to show my face. It's well overdue, so we're going to do that first. Moustache hair. I did get some new brow products. It's the Fill and Fluff uh, Eyebrow Pomade Pencil by NYX. The product itself is quite angled and a bit half like a half diamond shape. And then you've got like a little hair comb kind of brush to brush it out. So let's try this. The product feels like very creamy, I would say. I feel like they fixed their express espresso shade because normally in the micro pencil one they have the espresso is really red on me like a reddish brown whilst this is like the perfect shade right so far i'm quite pleased with that pencil i'm gonna get some brow gel now okay so i'm gonna use my tarte shape tape concealer in tan sand i'm gonna put some on the back of my hand first We just want it to be neat. We're now going to put some on our lids to act as our base. I'm so excited for the eyeshadow. Although I haven't done eyeshadow in a bit, so I feel like just, you know, I tried to film the other day, but I was so unmotivated. I literally put eyeshadow on, it looked so horrible. I took it all off, put everything away. There's no point in me filming when I'm not motivated. Like, literally, there's no point. So we're going to be using the new neon eyeshadow palette by Huda Beauty. This is the coral one. It doesn't have an individual name. So yeah, it's so beautiful. Look at that. I think I'm going to use the dark coral shade first. So far it's showing up really well. Let's just see how this is going to blend though with the other shades. I'm going to take the bright yellow in here which looks so stunning. I'm just going to blend that with our coral. There's quite a bit of fallout. I'm then going to grab some of that fuchsia shade and we're going to 
put this on the outer corner Now I'm, get, I'm using some of that corally shimmer shade. I'm gonna pat that all over that lid on the inner corner. It's a bit hard when I have full on long nails. I'm gonna see how this applies with a wet brush. So next up I'm going to use some of my Benefit Roller Liner in black. I'm just going to do a wing. I really like the combination of those colours. It's super bright, but I feel like it's really like Indian wedding kind of. I'm just gonna wipe that excess off. I'm just gonna do the other eye quickly and I'll be right back. For lashes today, I'm gonna be using the Blinky Lashes in the style Flutter. For moisturizer, I'm gonna use my Embryo D Slay Cream Concentre. I'm gonna apply some of this e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer. Um, I've been more into pore filling primers because of the pores I have now. So I'm just gonna apply this on my cheeks. For foundation today, we're gonna be using the Benefit Hello Happy Flawless Brightening Foundation in the shade seven. It's medium coverage liquid foundation with SPF 15. I've never tried this, I just received this recently, so yeah. So next I'm going to use the Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Concealer in the shade 300. I'm not too sure about the foundation, it does run a little bit light, but it's kind of adapted a little bit, although I had to put a bit more of a darker foundation around my mouth so that it doesn't go a bit ashy there. And the putty is not my favorite either, like I still see some texture whilst with the uh, Bella Pierre one that I've been using recently, that one's really nice, like it really does smooth. So that's it for now, let's go on to powder now. For powder I'm gonna use the Barry M Ready Set Powder in the shade Banana. Gonna apply this under the eyes. I haven't used this palette in ages. I'm gonna use the Maybelline Master Bronze Color and Highlighting Kit. on my nose as well. For blush, I'm gonna use the, the software blush in the hotspot by Lime Crime. Like, put some on the back of my hand first and then like tap it with my finger. And I'm gonna use the highlighter from the Maybelline palette.
From the Huda Beauty palette, I'm gonna put some of that neon fuchsia. Oh my god, actually this foundation looks really nice. My skin hasn't been the best lately, I don't know why. I drink so much water every day. Oh my god, I'm living for this eye look. For mascara, I'm gonna use the Paradise Ecstatic Mascara by L'Oreal. Then for lips, I'm going to use the Huda Beauty lipstick in Joyride. I just wanted to go with something a bit nude on the lips. Right, this is the finished look guys. I hope you enjoyed this quick makeup tutorial. To be honest, it's actually not that hard to do. The eyes are super easy. This palette was so beautiful. I really, really do like it. Let me know what you guys think. Leave a comment in the comments below. Um, I love you guys so much and I will see you in my next one. Bye!